okay YouTube users I'm gonna show you today how you can customize customize your boot animation the phone I'm gonna show you on is HTC one so for this the main condition is you need to be rooted and the phone should be S off as well if you don't know how to root your phone and you don't know how to do the S off on your phone I will make some videos for you to watch but at the moment this is the only video so people who got their phones rooted already they can follow my instructions on here and then they can customize that customize their boot animations so let's go ahead you need to download this app called root browser it's by j Rami. it's a famous developer on the xt threads so download that folder now you need to do another thing is go to one of the XTF forums threads and download a custom boot animation zip file which is not flashable once you have that file you need to go into this root browser then you need to go into system you need to go into customize you need to go into sources and then add that zip file in there you can see i've added the boot anim underscore digital underscore rain in there you also there are two other boot files in there one is htc boot up and the other one is down animations so these are the default ones which the phone uses to boot into that's why it comes up with that htc logo so we have added the new zip file in there as well now you make sure when you add that zip file you long press on the and go to permissions and change the permission exactly what you are sh seeing on the on the screen so the owner should have read and write and the group and the other should only have the read access and then you can press ok once that is done you need to go back and this time go to CID and inside there you'll find this default.xml file so long press on that and then click on open with now open with rb text editor take a few seconds to open it up for you once that is open you need to scroll all the way down until you see something called animation i'll show you okay now you need to careful look for this thing called boot animation animation system customize customize resource and then you need to exactly write the same name as is on the zip file exactly the same until dot zip don't change anything after that or anything before that once that's done you can save that there should be a save option on top and then you can go back and then that should be it this what what that xml file does is it points your boot animation to that file where it should boot to so once you change that file to the new file it should automatically boot to the new boot animation for you hopefully this video will help you to customize your boot animations and yeah keep on watching my more youtube videos coming in the coming days thanks for watching cheers